from God Bless You, Mr. Rosewater by Kurt Vonnegut. You mean fright about not getting enough to eat? About not being able to pay the doctor? About not being able to give your family nice clothes? A safe, cheerful, comfortable place to live? A decent education and a few good times? You mean shame about not knowing where the money river is? The what? The money river, where the wealth of the nation flows, we were born on the banks of it. We can slurp from that mighty river to our heart's content. And we even take slurping lessons so we can slurp more effectively. Slurping lessons from lawyers, from tax consultants. We're born close enough to the river to drown ourselves and the next 10 generations in wealth, simply using dippers and buckets. But we still hire the experts to teach us the use of aqueducts, dams, reservoirs, siphons, bucket brigades, and the Archimedes screw. And our teachers in turn become rich and their children become buyers of lessons in slurping. Is it still possible for an American to make a fortune on their own? Sure, provided somebody tells him when he's young enough that there is a money river. That there's nothing fair about it that he has to damn well forget about hard work and the merit system and honesty and all that crap and get to where the river is. Go where the rich and powerful are, I'd tell him, and learn their ways. They can be flattered and they can be scared. Please them enormously or scare them enormously. And one moonless night, they will put their fingers to their lips, warning you not to make a sound. And they will lead you through the dark to the wildest, deepest river of wealth ever known to man. You'll be shown your place on the bank and handed a bucket of your own. Slurp as much as you want, but Try to keep the racket of your slurping down. A poor man might hear you.